Store Manager for WooCommerce allows you to work offline, make bulk changes, upload products, images, and speed up thousands of other time-consuming operations. In this video, we'll show you Store Manager features that WooCommerce store owners love the most. Let's begin our overview with the categories and product section of the Store Manager for WooCommerce. As you can see, both categories and products are displayed within one screen. One of the top rated features here is Categories Import and Export. Also, you can assign products to a category easily. Select the products at the right pane and drop them over the category you want to assign products to. This way, you can move products from one category to another or assign products to the additional categories. Now, I want to show you some product management features that our customers call huge time savers. First of all, there is a built-in option to edit products as an Excel. Just click on the cell and you'll have an option to edit this field right in the grid. Let's update a few products this way. In case you need to edit any other data that is not available in the grid, you can select any product in the list and edit details in the bottom of the product section. Basically here you can see all product information editable without having to reload the page. Let's update the short description. Just add any text here. Do not forget to hit apply to save changes. Once applied, you can move to the next product and update it the same way. In case you're adding products manually and you need to clone products, use the clone button at the main menu. Just hit clone. Select options you would like to clone and edit the newly created product at the bottom. No need to wait while the page is loaded. It speeds up the process greatly. What is more, the Edit Products section allows you to change products massively. For example, let's select a few products you want to update and set some tags. Here I do not have any tags yet. So now I will add some tag for the selected products. Here it goes. Now the tag is added to all selected products. Same is true for categories. Mass operations for categories are also a huge time saver. Let's see how it works. You can assign multiple categories or unassign them here by checking the appropriate checkboxes. Do not forget to apply changes. That's how you can assign or unassign categories to your products. Finally, here you can upload and assign one image or multiple images to your products. Let's select multiple products without images and upload featured images or gallery images to them at a time. Click here to select images from the gallery or upload from your computer. Here how it goes. What is more, you can upload the image from a browser or even from the search results. Check copyrights and trademarks before applying third-party images. So here you can see that I've assigned new images to my products. Basically, almost every section is a mass updater here. In case you need more advanced rules to be applied massively, you can use Mass Changer. It can be found in the main menu. It enables you with smart rules, like update price by value or percentage, append or prepend values to the description or replace values with any custom rule. For example, let's increase prices by 10%. Here are my prices before the update. Let's use the mass changer. Select the field regular price. Apply the rule to increase price by 10%. You can preview changes before applying them to your data. Once you check the result, hit OK and changes will be applied. The prices are updated. In case you need more detailed instructions on the mass changer, please see links in the description below. One more hidden life-saving tool is a variation generator. By the way, the store manager supports all product types. So when you select the variable product, you will see an additional variations tab. Here you can see all attributes and variations, if any. Also, here you can generate variants for your product massively. Let's find some products without variants yet. Here I have one. Let's generate them in bulk. Before you can generate variations, you need to select attributes you want to apply to your product. If you have none selected, you will see a hint, helping you to proceed to the Attributes tab and select some. For example, 
Let's select color and size in the attribute section. I'll select all options for the color and size. Also, do not forget to enable use for variation checkbox. Apply changes now. After that, go to the WooCommerce Variations tab and use the generator to create all available variants. Pay attention to settings available in the left pane. Here you can set all settings of the newly generated variations. At the right pane, you can see the list of attributes available for this product and attributes that are used to create variations. Move needed attributes that you would like to generate product variations from to the right. Other attributes can be left in the available attributes list. I have added all the terms configured for color and size attributes. Let's generate variants now. Hit OK and you'll see your variations generated instantly. Here you can see them all generated. What is more, you can apply changes to the variations massively. You can enable or disable variant. Make it downloadable or virtual. And set the regular price additionally. A new option available from now is the ability to add and manage the reviews. Under the review section, you can add a new comment, edit or delete the previously added. One more powerful option worth mentioning that was not covered yet is products export and import. With the store manager for WooCommerce, you can import products from Excel, Google Sheets, CSV, XML, and zip files. No requirements to file. You can adjust the file on the fly. Store Manager offers multiple options worth mentioning, so I would encourage you to check a separate products import video to see all opportunities you have here. Find the link in the description below. Also worth mentioning that you can import images right from your supplier's link, local computer, or any other external link. No need to upload images to your server upfront. You can also find related videos in the description below. Besides import, you can find an export tool that allows you to export WooCommerce products and related details to CSV or Excel file for further use. The last but not least are the filtering possibilities. You can sort products by any criteria, search for the item, or create your custom filters. That's not all we would like to show you, though it is time to move to other sections of the store manager. Let's expand our menu and see what is worth mentioning here. The catalog menu contains products and categories that we've reviewed already. Also here you can find the attribute section where you can add, edit, or modify your attributes. Media library section shows your media library to find or update required images or upload them. Here in the product tag section, you can see the same menu with mass changer, export, and import. Under the comments section, you can find all reviews available on your store. Also, you can manage them or upload in bulk using the import functionality. As you can see, switching between sections is really fast as there is no need to wait for the browser page to load. Under the customers section, you can edit, add, and update users. Also, you can navigate or update your coupons codes and find your shipping classes. Now let's move to the section your online store is ultimately made for. The orders. You can filter created orders, generate invoices, and receipts in one click. Let's see how you can massively update them. For example, let's generate receipts for multiple orders at once. Select all orders you need. Use the Generate Receipts option. Check the result and print all receipts. That's how easy it is done. Also, you can change order status in bulk. For example, let's update the order status for the selected orders to canceled. Use Change Status option. Select New Status and apply the change. That's it. The status was changed. Also worth mentioning that orders import and export is available for you. See more detailed instructions on this feature in the description below. If you run a brick and mortar store, use point of sale to quickly create orders, calculate change and print receipts. Barcode scanner supported. Here is how quickly you can create a new order. Scan the product or type the title, 
add the product to your order, check the customer, and hit create and stay. That's it. One more time, scan, add the product, check, and hit F7. Also, you can use the F12 to create and print invoice or receipt. This is one of the most wanted features in the order section. Hope it will be useful for you too. Finally, working with Store Manager, you can connect to multiple WooCommerce stores and manage them using one application. You can even work offline and publish changes to your live store later. Along with the Store Manager features, you can find powerful plugins such as Scheduled Import and Export with snapshots of all procedures. Amazon, eBay, and IceCAD integrations. PDF Catalog Creator for printable or downloadable catalogs and lookbooks. And QuickBooks integration. Do you have any time-consuming tasks ahead? Most likely the store manager has a tool to automate it. Contact us and our manager will gladly talk with you and offer the best solution for you specifically. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching this far and wishing you a wonderful day ahead.